Patrick Day. Miss McClear. Where are you off to? I'm giving a talk. A talk? On decommissioning hearts. I see the look in their faces as he decommissioned his. Well, have you? The heart's a deep container. Loads of old baggage. You can't change your past. All you can do is offer it up to God. And what if God says no thanks? God never says that. God says bugger all. You're not a believer? I believe if there is a God, he's a mean bastard. Why would anyone want to kill a man like Paul? I think you must know why. I want you to tell me. It wasn't about individuals. We saw the RUC as the forces of occupation. We? My community. Your unit, you mean? I don't have a unit. You did once. Based in County Monaghan, are you denying it? No, but that's all in the past. You haven't changed much in ten years. Prison must have suited you. I didn't pick up on the name at first. Patrick Day. A blank name. A nice, innocent name. I suppose a lot of ex-prisoners hide behind false names. Not false. New. A new name. Oh, no. That's far too easy. Your real name is Sean O'Dearan. Sean O'Dearan's a terrorist. I am not that man anymore. I hate him as much as you do. The murderer of my son, sleeping with my daughter. Miss McClear, it's a terrible coincidence. Her daddy's murderer. Her little brother's murderer. I wanted to tell you to go down on my knees in front of you all and say I was sorry. Sorry? Sorry? Sorry, me shit. I was too much of a coward. Polly watched them die. Soldiers have to obey orders. Soldiers. Miss McClear, look. I know apologies are no good to you. But I swear, if I could undo what I did that day, I would. Of course you would. Now. I've begun to hate myself, not just because of Polly. You've told her. Not yet. But I will. You'll get out of our lives, you snivelling little probey bastard. Don't go anywhere near my daughter. Don't touch her. Don't say one word to her, because if you do, I'll kill you. <laughs>